Bereshith, Genesis 6. And it came to pass, when men began to multiply on the face of the earth, and daughters were born unto them, that the sons of Elohim saw Eth, the daughters of men, that they were fair, and they took them women of all which they chose. And Yahuwah said, My Ruach shall not always strive with man, for that he also is flesh. Yet his days shall be a hundred and twenty years. There were Nephilim in the earth in those days, and also after that, when the sons of Elohim came in unto the daughters of men, and they bore children to them, the same became warriors and tyrants, which were of ancient times men of infamy. And Yahuwah saw that the wickedness of man was great in the earth, and that every imagination of the thoughts of his heart was only evil continually. And it repented Yahuwah that he had made eth man on the earth, and it grieved him at his heart. And Yahuwah said, I will destroy eth man whom I have created from the face of the earth, both man and beast, and the creeping thing, and the fowls of the air, for it repents me that I have made them. But Noach found grace in the eyes of Yahuwah. These are the generations of Noach. Noach was a just man and perfect in his generations. And Noach walked with Eth Elohim. And Noach begat three sons, Eth Shem, Eth Cham, and Eth Yepheth. The earth also was corrupt before Elohim, and the earth was filled with violence. And Elohim looked up, Eth, rather, upon the earth, rather, and Elohim looked upon Eth, the earth, and behold, it was corrupt. For all flesh had corrupted Eth, his way upon the earth. And Elohim said unto Noach, The end of all flesh is come before me, for the earth is filled with violence through them. And behold, I will destroy them with Eth, the earth. Make you Eth, an ark of gopher wood. Rooms shall you make in the ark, and shall pitch it within and without with pitch. And this is the fashion which you shall make it of. The length of the ark shall be three hundred cubits, the breadth of it fifty cubits, and the height of it thirty cubits. A window shall you make to the ark, and in a cubit shall you finish it above, and the door of the ark shall you set in the side thereof, with lower, second, and third stories shall you make it. And behold, I, even I, do bring eth a flood upon the earth, a flood of waters upon the earth, to destroy all flesh. Wherein is the breath of life from under heaven and everything that is in the earth shall die. But with you will I establish F my covenant and you shall come into the ark you and your sons and your woman and your sons' women with you. And of every living thing of all flesh, two of every sort shall you bring into the ark to keep them alive with you. They shall be male and female. Of fowls after their kind and of cattle after their kind, of every creeping thing of the earth after his kind, 
Two of every sort shall come unto you to keep them alive. And take unto you of all food that is eaten, and you shall gather it to you, and it shall be for food for you and for them. Thus did Noah, according to all that Elohim commanded him, so did he.